Hello everyone. Welcome back to online spoken English class. In this session, we will learn about the use of verbs like can, may, could and would. Let's begin. Can I please go to the toilet, ma'am? Do you think the above request by the student is correct? Yes or no? You get it right. The above request is not correct because can denotes capability of the student. The request should have been May I please go to the toilet, ma'am? Here, the expected reply will be Yes. You may. Let's look at these sentences. May I have your attention please? Can you maintain silence please? Could you please repeat what I said? Would you mind reading this please? Have you noticed something in these sentences? Okay, let's repeat it once again and observe the difference in the sentences. May I have your attention please? Can you maintain silence please? Could you please repeat what I said? Would you mind reading this please? You must have noted that all the four models are being used for request. What is the difference? The difference lies in the degree of politeness. The words like can, may, could, would, will, shall, should, must, might and ought are also verbs but they are of a special kind. These words are called model auxiliaries. The functions of model auxiliaries are request, possibility, ability, permission, necessity, prohibition, advice, certainty. Remember, many models have more than one meaning. Now, let's notice what do these sentences indicate. If we run, we could reach home quickly. I believe I can run faster than her. It may rain today. I thought it would rain. So, I brought my umbrella. Now, repeat these sentences after me. If we run, we could reach home quickly. I believe I can run faster than her. It may rain today. I thought it would rain, so I brought my umbrella. What do the highlighted words indicate? Here, could, can, may and would. I used to show how likely things are to happen means these words are expressing degrees of possibility. Let's see what these words indicate in a sentence. Can indicates ability, permission, request, 
possibility. May indicates wish, permission, request, possibility. Could indicates past ability, possibility, permission, request. Would indicates polite request, permission, future possibility, necessity. In this session, till now, we saw the use of these words can, may, could and would in two ways as request and possibility. Let's see what do these words indicate in these sentences. Repeat the sentences after me. You can take one of these books. Here, can indicates permission. I can lift this box. Here, can indicates ability. May you live long. Here, may indicates wish. She may win the race. Here, may indicates possibility. Could I have a look at your notes? Here, could indicates polite request. Till last year, I could read without glasses. Here, could indicates pass ability. Would you open the door, please? Here, would indicates polite request. The bridge would probably fall by next year. It is so old. Here would indicate future possibility. In this module, we have learned the functions of model verbs, importance of model verbs, can, may, could, and would in a sentence. In the next module, we will listen to the conversation based on model verbs expressing a variety of moods or attitudes of the speaker. Thank you.